Hey my loves, welcome back to my channel and I hope you guys are doing good today. If you are someone new to my channel, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you like it. I hope you like the vibe and I do videos on makeup, skincare and hauls. If that's the video you want to see then please subscribe to this channel and also turn on the notification button so that you don't miss any of my posts. Now mostly I get DMs on my post that how do I do curls and I have certain plans of doing some videos and for that I'm getting ready and I have a specific mindset for a specific kind of curls so that I'm gonna do and I thought why not to film this for you so that your queries will be dealt and you'll be knowing how to do curls. Now before showing you the actual process, let me tell you the things that you need to do your curls. Now first of all, you will be needing a comb and a brush. So I use this kind of a brush and this kind of a comb to do sectioning and parting of my hair. You're gonna need a hair protectant. So for today's video, I'm using this hair protectant and this is from Schwarzkopf. This is their Bonacare Peptide Rescue Nutri Shield Serum. Too big name, but this is a star product. And next item that you're gonna need is this kind of hair mousse and this is from Schwarzkopf. This is their that power moves and it has got a very good hold and the power is 5 and this is an optional item this is from again Schwarzkopf this is a you know shine boosting lacquer that I like to use so this also you can grab and the main item that you need to do your curl is this kind of wand uh, this is from Remington. I have been using this wand for around six years now, so I quite like it. Now let's just quickly start the video. Uh, so whenever you are doing your curls, make sure you're very close to mirror and you have plenty source of light because these kind of rods uh, they they heat up very quickly and. If you are not cautious, you might burn yourself. So you have to have a good source of light as well as a mirror. So this curl is going to stay at least for three days if you don't wash your hair. Otherwise, it is going to stay put for three days. Now, let's just start the tutorial what I do to do curls. So my hair is clean and dry. All I need to do is I have to first put a heat protectant and I'm gonna use this serum as my heat protectant. So I'll take generously three to four pumps of this serum. Then I'll be warming it up. I'll be applying it from the middle part to tip of my hair like this. And rest whatever is left that I will be combing through with my palms. little bit on my crown as well so I have nicely drenched my hair with heat protectant and not necessarily you have to use the same heat protectant whatever heat protectant you have that you're going to use because uh, you're going to give a lot of heat to develop those curls and you must protect your hair because styling is something and you know caring your hair is something so do not forget that so the next thing that you're supposed to do is you have to remove any tangle present in your hair so i'm using my tangle teaser so that there is no tangle present in my hair the next thing that you're gonna need is this kind of clutch clips and this is for you know holding your partition so I'll show what I do. I'm just taking a comb to do my partition. So I have made very thin section of my hair and 
I will be starting with this section. So I have turned on the bond and I kept the temperature at 300. This is like quite a bit high but still it will make the process very fast. And since I have heat protectant so I don't need to think that much about the heat temperature. So let's begin. Make sure that you take small chunks of hair. In that way you're going to get better curls. Now I'll be taking this mosh and I'll create the curl and this is how the foam will come out. Okay, this is a good amount. Now what I'm doing is I'm just placing the mosh on the section which I want to curl. And the smell is not that bothering. Little more. Okay. So in this way, your hair is protected also, nourished also, and you are able to make curl. Now I'll be taking this wand and I'll hold it like this and I'll wrap the hair and I'll do my curl. And I will wait for around 20 seconds. Now I'll loosen up. You see, this is how the curl is looking. So make sure that you take small section in that way you will get very nice curls. So that's what I'm doing. Taking the mosh. A little twisting. So half of my hair is done and let's make the rest. So again I'm doing partition. Let's start with this section this time.
Now I'll do the top section. This is just the same process I'm doing. Nothing interesting, but after this, the whole transformation is really worth, guys. So it's taking a little time. Uh, what I feel is I'll quickly complete my hair and I'll come back. That will be in that way. I'm going to save a lot of time of mine as well as yours. This is the final look or transformation from flat to curl. So this is how my hair is looking and I am quite happy how my curls have turned. <laughs> and later on I'll be, you know, drawing fingers, I'll break them to make them more soft. I'll make sure the mousse gets completely dried in my hair and this is how my curl is looking. Now to finish this up, I'll be adding little gloss. This is an extra step. You can totally skip but I feel like in this way my hair will look more shiny. So if you have enjoyed this video then please give this video a big thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to my channel then please take a moment to subscribe this channel and also share this video to your friends and family and today I shall be wrapping up and I'll be seeing you in another video till then you take care and bye bye.